Chin-ups, great exercise for working our back. And they're like pull-ups, but instead of having an overhand grip, using some kind of underhand grip like this. And as a result, you're engaging more of your bicep muscle. So just like the pull-ups, you want to start beginner level, find some kind of railing like this. And remember, underhand grip, not overhand. Stretch out like that, don't stick out your glutes, chest out nice and proud, and you pull all the way. You pull. You pull like that. Keep your chest out nice and proud always. So once you can do 10 repetitions with good form, take it to squat, chin ups like this, chest out nice and proud, and pull. Remember, don't cheat by just squatting up like this. No. Don't cheat. Make sure that you're actually pulling. Feel, feel yourself actually pulling on your back. Like that. Pull, chest out nice and proud. Control down, don't just drop. One more. Control down. All right, so you can now do 10 repetitions with good form. You want to begin challenging yourself with negative chin-ups. Let's check out what that looks like. So of course, if you have a normal pull-up bar, you know, you can do the pull-ups easily. But if you're in a home setting, like this kind of setting, you have to improvise. So of course, if you have a door frame and you trust the integrity of it, you could use the door frame. But if you don't, there are some people who, who buy the, the, the home pull-up bars. Well, I guess still you have to be trusting the door frame. But I know a couple of friends who use them and they don't have any problems with them. But again, just like before, the, the, so the positive of the motion would be as you pull yourself up. But if you're not yet that strong, you can begin with negatives. So what that would look like is, so chin-ups, I'm using this kind of grip, not an overhand grip, kind of reversed grip like this. And just like work on the negative first. So jump up and then Squeeze all the way down. Jump up again. <laughs> Get that? And once you can do eight to 10 repetitions of those, you can now begin actually doing full chin-ups. <laughs> and with chin-ups, you want to make sure that you keep, if your purpose is to build muscle, you want to make sure that you keep the chest out, that you don't, kind of pull while cringing in. You want to be pulling, keep looking up, and pulling, think of pulling this upper frame to your chest. So you're pulling it down to your chest. Don't carve in like that.